Dominic Toretto and his crew of professional criminals have retired around the world following their successful Rio heist, Dominic lives with his new girlfriend Elena, his sister Mia lives with Brian O'Connor and their son Jack, Giselle and Han have moved to Hong Kong, and Roman and Tej live in luxury. Meanwhile, Luke Hobbs and Riley Hicks of the Diplomatic Security Service, DSS, investigate the destruction of a Russian military convoy by former British Special Forces veteran Owen Shaw and his team. Hobbs locates Dominic and persuades him to assist in the capture of Shaw after giving him a current photo of Dominic's previous girlfriend, the ostensibly long-dead Letty Ortiz. Dominic assembles his team, and they accept the task in exchange for full amnesty for their previous crimes, allowing them to return to the United States, Mia and Elena remain with Jack. The gang proceeds to London, where one of Shaw's henchmen leads them to Shaw's hideaway, which turns out to be a trap set to distract the crew and police while Shaw's group commits a theft elsewhere. Shaw departs by automobile, detonating his hideaway behind him and rendering the majority of the cops ineffective, leaving Dominic, Brian, Tej, Han, Giselle, Hobbs, and Riley to follow him. Letty arrives to assist Shaw and immediately shoots Dominic before fleeing. Back at their base, Hobbs informs Dominic's team that Shaw is taking components to build a nightshade gadget capable of disabling electricity in an entire region, which he wants to sell to the highest bidder. Meanwhile, Shaw's inquiry into the opposing team exposes Letty's relationship with Dominic, but she has amnesia and is now a brainwashed associate working for Shaw. Dominic's team looks into a Shaw subordinate who uncovers Shaw's ties to Arturo Braga, a drug kingpin imprisoned by Brian few years before. Brian returns to the US as a prisoner in order to obtain access to Braga, who reveals how Letty survived the explosion that was supposed to have killed her. Shaw allegedly tried to kill her, but after learning of her amnesia, he took her in. Brian gets freed from prison Dominic challenges Letty to a street racing battle in London and then returns her jewelry, which he had kept. Tej follows Shaw's second strike all the way to a NATO facility in Spain. His group attacks a military truck carrying a computer chip that will be used to finish the nightshade gadget. While Dominic's team destroys the convoy, Shaw, followed by Letty, commandeers a tank and begins demolishing automobiles on the roadway. Brian and Roman successfully turn the tank, Letty is ejected from the tank, and Dominic risks his life to save her from drowning. Shaw and his men are apprehended, but he discloses that he abducted Mia and that his men would kill her if he is not released. The crew is compelled to release Shaw, and Riley, who is ultimately revealed to be a double agent working for Shaw, joins him. Letty stays with Dom, Shaw's gang boards a huge airplane that is in motion on a runway, while Dominic's team pursues. Dominic, Letty, Brian, and Hobbs board the vessel. Brian saves Mia, and the four of them escape using a vehicle on board. The plane tries to take off but is stymied by additional weight when Han, Giselle, Roman, Tej, Brian, and Mia attach it to their automobiles. Giselle gives herself up to defend Han from one of Shaw's goons, whom she kills, but falls to her death from the plane. Letty murders Riley and flees to safety with Hobbs, while Dominic chases Shaw and the computer chip. Shaw is ejected from the jet as it crashes into the ground, Dom drives one of the surviving vehicles into the nose of the exploding plane and rejoins his men, handing Hobbs the chip to guarantee their amnesty. Dominic and his squad return to the United States in the aftermath. Hobbs and Elena arrive to confirm the crew's availability, Elena accepts Dominic's preference for Letty above her. As Dominic's team gathers at his house for a lunch, Dominic asks Letty whether the gathering seems familiar, she says no but it feels like home. During an automobile chase in Tokyo during the mid-credits, Han gets struck by an incoming car. Han is killed as his automobile explodes. The driver of the other car walks away from the scene and contacts Dominic, leaving a voicemail that begins, you don't know me, you're about to.